Last looks, please. <laughs> Hi, Ranella. Hi. Are you ready for today? A little bit nervous. Yeah. I'm so self conscious. Oh, no, I can barely zip up my hips. <laughs> Not for long. Hi, Mommy. She's dressed up and you're not. I'm not a beauty pageant queen. My youngest sister, his name is Ariel. She's a beauty pageant queen. And my mom's bakery is, of course, named after her. And she always compares me to her because she's Little Miss Perfect. Where are you going? You have to. I have dance practice later. <laughs> and you? I'm eating right now. I can't think. Oh, my god. Typical. Oh, my god, Ranel. What are you wearing? Cover your body. It's like you came from the bed. Oh, my god. You're going to eat again? No, don't eat. Don't eat right no, now. No, I'm really hungry, Mommy. Sometimes I don't even want to see my mom because I know she's just going to have something bad to say. Why do you have to be like that? Because, Mommy, it's hard. I'm working so much. I don't have time. You don't have time? Uh -huh. You can make time. Why? You work 24 hours a day? Where's the money? But even if you're working, there's gyms that are open 24 hours. <laughs> What's the food right now? I'm saying same Literally, huh? you're eating everything. See? Oh, my God. My mom has hurt my feelings, of course. I feel like I've been the neglected child, and I'm looked at as the black sheep of the family. Your other sister, they're a nurse, an accountant. You don't do that. But you're not yeah, even performing anymore. Not. Yeah. I've been singing since I was a little girl. I do pop, R&B, you name it, I can do it. I got a phone call to open up for Nelly and Twista and Keisha Cole. I was like the first Asian artist performing all over Hollywood. My weekend has made me lose my voice because I stopped singing and I lost my confidence. It's been a long time. You long to be famous, to be known in singing. But how can you be famous when you are... I don't really feel loved by my mother as much as I would like. I feel like my mom just looks at me in disgust. Hi, pretty girl. Watch your step. Sorry, this is Renella. Hi. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Thank you for coming. Thank you so much for having me. Are you excited? A little nervous. But I'm okay. You know this. You look great. <sighs> Normally, I'd wear a waist trainer. Okay. Got it from you. Thank you very much. Love a good waist trainer. <laughs> but now I'm like, you know what? It's okay. I'm going to let everyone know. Yeah, let's what see the I'm transformation. Yeah. Tell me your story. Like, what got you here? I'm originally from the Philippines. Okay. So my mom and my dad separated when I was seven. Okay. And that's when it started. Um, my mom flew to America. Mm -hmm. I was stuck with my dad. Mm -hmm. I wasn't allowed to see my mom for six years, not even speak her name. No way. So me and my oldest sister was stuck there, and my brother and my younger sister came to America first. Did you ever talk to your mom? Uh, secretly. Mm. And a six year later, she took us, and we ran away. Wow. So when I got to America, my mom and I would argue. Why? She wanted to me to be a nurse as I was growing up. Mm -hmm. And here I am, I'm like, no, you don't understand. I've been singing, I'm a singer. Just, right. this is what I want to do. And so I kind of been rebellious towards whatever she wanted me to do. I want to hear you sing. Okay. When I do my thing, I'm a winner. Ooh. I was so scared that you were going to suck for a second. I was like, oh, God, please don't do this. You have a great voice. Thank you. You have so a great voice. I appreciate it. So what would you say triggered all this weight gain? My mom used to look at me and think I was a loser because I was pursuing music, but yet I was broke. So I started working a lot more. I had no time to work out. I was tired. I would work 10-hour days. I stopped doing music. And from not doing music, it got me depressed. Yeah. And then next thing you know, I just started eating and eating. Yeah. I gained like over 50 pounds. Now I don't want to go to parties. I don't want to perform. If someone takes a picture of me, I'm like, dude, take that down. I'm so embarrassed. I don't right. want to be seen. I mean, I get it. Like, my weight has always yo-yoed. And like, my brother, you know, gained a lot of weight. 
I totally understood because I was in his shoes, like not wanting to be seen. Like he would literally only leave the house when it was dark that's, outside. And that's how I feel. What is your end goal? Is it to be a singer and to be on that stage again? Yes. And to let your mom not call you fat anymore? anymore? I just want to tell my mom, like, I wish, I'm sorry that you guys separated when I, I was younger, but I was a mommy's girl. She was like my best friend. And I want that again. And I want my mom to look at me and be proud. I, I honestly don't feel love. And I think that's why I've let myself go. I have this magnificent trainer that specializes in like sculpting a body. And literally will give you whatever you want. You're like, okay, I want these kind of arms or this kind of waist. He can do that for you. Okay. This is gonna be like the first day of a major change in your life. I'm so excited. And only great things are gonna happen after this. Yeah.